Hey everyone. All right, so we're just uh, ironing out a small issue, just trying to get Matt in. Let me see here. We're just doing some quick work. Let's see here. Uh, we're just going to try to get a quick working thing here. Let me... Get a workaround going on. All right, so let's give this a second. All right, so, um, you know, just to have a formal background here, uh, this is the result of uh, this debate is the result of, you know, me being essentially a pretty aggressive Bitcoin maximalist on Twitter. Is there still an echo? Testing, 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 testing. Let me see. Oh, is that is that good news? Am I hearing some good news? Nope. I don't believe that was him entering the chat like I was hoping. Now we need to figure out a way to get him in. Is anyone here that uh, knows anything about Google Hangouts in the chat that can say, uh, you know, I sent him the link. He clicked on it, and it's uh, kind of like a like a like a waiting screen. And this is not very customary. Um, really want to get this working. Let's see here. So just, you know, thank you for sticking around. Please bear with me for a second. Um, now we're, we're looking at the, I'm looking at the comments while we're trying to figure this out, you know, so, so let me jump right back in. Um, I'm actually, you know, a, a pretty, aggressive Bitcoin maximalist and, and I want the audience to understand that I'm approaching this 100% neutral. I'm looking forward to an objective fact-based debate and everyone pretty much agreed that Matt Hamilton is an excellent candidate for this and I'm really looking forward to an in-depth analysis at the various um, fundamental elements of Ripple like uh, you know X current, X rapid. Um, we want to look at the consensus mechanism, we want to look at amendments and then we want to hit a couple debatable issues. Now, keep in mind, although I am a Bitcoin maximalist, I will be 100% neutral. And the questions that I ask, some might be a little more tough than others, but I promise you, this is only coming from an objective standpoint. If you feel like you know I'm slanting, you know, in one way or another, feel free to to you know throw out a um, a comment, and you know I'll I'll happily uh, address that. Let me pop back in. Um, I'm, I'm, uh, work, I'm trying to work with Matt here. For, for some reason, he's not able to get into um, he's not able to get into this hangout. So it's possible I'm going to have to reset this, and uh, I'm just finding out one second if that's going to be our attempted solution. So just bear with me, I'll, I'll keep talking and I'm, I'm looking at the comments here. So if you have anything that uh, you want me to address right now, if you have any questions you wanna ask me personally, feel free to ask You know, while, while we're sorting this out. And um, you know, let's, let's make this you know, a nice, pleasant discussion. Um, and of course, you're welcome, um, a neutral maximalist. Yeah, you know, what I realized in this space is there's so much, uh, you know, so much aggressive activity. And that includes for me, that includes from, you know, probably 
you know, a lot of people in XRP, a lot of people in Litecoin, every single cryptocurrency, right? So, you know, after after just you know discussing in in aggressively you know attacking XRP and you know talking to some people that I realized were good people, I decided to make a little bit of a switch. I said, you know what? We we need to put our swords down and we need to have a talk, you know, and 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 all this aggressive um you know calling xrp a scam you know and and you know xrp saying various things you know I, I agree that that was not the right way to approach the situation what we should do and what the space needs more of is an objective look so I, i'm i'm really trying to provide that here and we're going to um uh we're going to try to make this work all right so I'm going to try something here. Hey, Matt, can you hear me? Yeah, I don't see you, but uh, and I and the audience won't be able to hear you. They'll only be able to hear me right now. So just so the audience is aware, I was able to get into his hangout. For some reason, he can't get into my hangout. And uh, no, I don't see a camera. Um, so. Ladies and gentlemen, we're just moving through some technical, you know, just, you know, the mumbo jumbo that you deal with uh, when you're doing things live sometimes. Yeah, I can I can hear you, Matt. And uh, what we need to do is get you in my hangout so that this can be live. Um, why why am I able to get into yours and you can't get into mine? Is no idea. All right. Uh, so, all right. All right. Yep. So, uh, Matt, can you hear me still? Do you want me to uh, reset the uh, the stream? Matt's typing. I'm just giving him a sec here. Oh, Matt left this call. I'm gonna hang up on this call as well. Mm -mm -mm. Okay, so uh, I got a question here. Uh, can you give me some insight on Bitcoin scalability future-wise? So uh, yeah, absolutely. The Lightning Network is pretty much the scaling solution to Bitcoin Core, right? Um, now, well, the Lightning Network is it created a system of off-chain. Oh, no, hold on. Uh, guys, we're gonna. Um, I'm gonna cancel this stream, and we're going to start it right back up. Uh, I'll post a new link. Uh, I'm pretty sure you'll just if you just stay on the Block TV channel, you'll see a live video come up right away. So give me give me a minute. Um, we're just gonna give this a try. I really want this to work out. So let me uh, just bear with me. I'll be back in uh, you know seconds. <laughs> 